Yo, what is going on, guys? Roger and Omar from OTI Gaming TV. Yo, yo. And today, we've got a little money, credit, unlimited gift for you guys. Omar's going to run it because he knows more about this game than I do. Take away everything. First of all, you need to buy one of these car, guys. You need to buy the Forza Edition M6 BMW. That's what you need to buy. For those of you that don't know how to buy it, we'll go to the festival auction, type in BMW, but Omar will show you. Yeah, you if you it. don't know how to do it, guys, you just go to the H, which is located here. You jump to the Horizon Festival, you go inside the Horizon Festival, you find it, you buy it. Most of you should actually have it because you do win them through the spins and stuff like that, so we just get on it like that. But yeah, you need an M6 Forza Edition, not a normal one, a Forza one. It'll give you a drift bonus. And what you want to do. Right. And what you want to do, guys, is you want to go and... Raja, you can do this as well, yeah? So press the, uh, like, options button. Yep. Menu. Now, majority of people will have what I got at the top, which is it says cars, and it'll say, like, 9+. plus. Yeah. You probably got, like, a million of them. No, it says 9+, plus as well. But, yeah. Yeah. Uh, you click on where it says car mastery. Okay, X. Unlock perk. So the first perk on this is already bought, which is gain your like instant 5,000 credits. You don't really care about them, they're, they're pointless. What you want to start looking for is stuff like this. So it says get 10% more influence when driving. Yeah, look, drift. Yep. So look the one above it. Wreckage. The first one, it says drift. So I'm unlock that for three. I don't really have many guys. We're going to gain loads on this though, so yeah. I'm doing everything. I'm just going to buy do maybe. Yeah, you can do them all because you got you got loads of points. I don't. We're going to make points in this video and show them what we're going to do. So uh, I'm just going to buy this one anyway. Here's another tip for you guys, which most people don't know, is if you yeah. actually do have one where it says custom sound system, you can read what it says there. It says the car builds the skill multiplier much faster. You'll leave the radio on, and it'll find a certain song playing, and when it does, it'll say. At the top in yeah. yellow, uh, this is a multiplier song, so just drift, crash, drive around, do mad shit, and it will um, multiply it quick times. So I'm gonna buy that anyway. This last one is always 25. Always. Right? Always. <laughs> so, that's because it gives you the chance not to lose your multiplier basically. Oh, is it if you crash? Yeah, that's that's the one that's the guardian angel. So if you crash and oh. I crash, I'll lose my points, but you won't. If you crash again, then I'll we'll lose them. Then okay, I've maxed out everything. Yeah, so you got flying car. You don't really want that. Ultimate thrill, no. Drive without fear, no. no. See stuff like that. Your car's multiplier builds three or times as fast. It costs five, so I'm gonna buy that. I need to make more so I can buy this one, this one, this one, this one, this one, this one, all these guys. So we're going to make the points now. The... I'm going to show you exactly how to make yeah. the points to get your points. And then I'm going to show you how to spend your points and get cars and get money, basically. All right, let's go, bro. So we are going to go inside here to the airstrip. You can even start doing it from here. Yeah, you just, just gotta drift your car. You just literally gotta drift your car left and right. The more you drift it, the more points you're gonna get at the top. The more points you get at the top, the more it's gonna give you those uh, skill points. The more skill points you get, the more it's gonna work out better for you guys, and you're gonna end up buying cars at the end of it, which I'm gonna show you which cars to buy. I'm gonna stop now a sec. So, what's it give me already? I mean, look at that. I wasn't even doing nothing. It's giving me like 17, 18. Look. You see what I'm saying, guys? And I wasn't even doing it. Raja, I've done a mad one. You see that? Oof. I'm on, I'm, I'm on 14,000, bro. And I've got hit. Yeah, yeah, that's what I think, yeah. So, look, guys. I'm just going to do a mad drift here. It's best to do it here because there's no cars. As you can see, it's just dead. I'm just doing mad stuff here guys, I'm just 
I'm already at 40,000. I know I am 11. Wow. And the more you do this, the more points you end up with, the more points you end up with, the more stuff you end up with, and then you can just keep doing it and doing it and doing it, and you'll end up with everything. You'll but the more points money, you get, then you get cars as well, right? I'm going to stop here again. So I'm on 16.8 times 5 already, guys. I'm only doing it slowly to show you how, how you can get the skill points. Look, I got one. Boom. I got two. I'm on 40,000 times 7. So give me two skill points and halfway to the next one. I could even just crash into stuff like this. And it'll still do the same. It'll have the same effect. What this does, guys, it gives you more points. More points allow you to survive. More money or more health. Uh, what it will do, yeah, is it will give you more points, right? So when you get more points, you can then go ahead and purchase a car, which I'm going to do in a bit. I'm going to show you which one. I'm going to purchase a car. When you purchase that car, it allows you then to use your perk points, buy the two perks, which are cheap. And I'm sure you get like three, 300 or 30 grand. I'm not sure you know. I go. can't actually remember. You get money with it as well. There you go. But you get money and you get a car, and then obviously you get to sell the car. So what we need to do now, guys, is we need to go to um, the Horizon Festival. Right, so you jump to the Horizon Festival. Wait. What you want to do is go across to Auction House and then go to Search Cars. As you can see, mine was on some Hoonigan. Because that's the last car I bought. You go to the Porsche, and it's the old one. Yeah, um, I'm just going to go to any. Which one is it? So, it's this one here. The Porsche 911 Turbo 3.3 1982. So I'm just going to buy this outright. Look, I'm going to buy it. Oh, I see it. 1982. Got it. Yeah, so I'm going to buy this one outright, yeah? And then car. So Rajar's going to do the same thing in the background, guys. Done it. And he's going to tell you exactly what happens on his screen. Because his screen is going to be different to my screen. Because I don't have a lot of points. But he's going to show you what you have to do. So remember, you need to buy the Porsche 911 Turbo 3.3 1982. So what you want to do now is go back to where it says cars on the menu. Yep. Oh, let, me, to the car let, let, let me record this now, so I'm going to record it from my angle. Start recording. Yeah, I'm on cars. Yeah, so now go to the Abdi. Look, what do you see? Oh, it's already got five out of six perks on it already. Yeah, but what do you see? Oh, okay. we will spend so money. Very carefully, yeah, look, 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 look. If you see very carefully now, mm. what you do, guys, is you buy the first one, which is already bought on this car. You buy the second one, which will cost you one, and three is four. That makes it nine. Mine's already four. So you need Mine's 19 four. points to give you 300,000. That's how the glitch works, guys. That's basically the top and tail of it. You buy that car. You earn the points. You earn the points. You buy this car. You spend the points on this car. And then you get 300,000 every time. That's, That's money, bro. The gist of it. That's so much money, you understand? brother. So much. So what you'll do then is buy another one of these Porsches. You always buy a spin. stock one. It is best to buy a stock one. Yeah. Then you will always be able to buy them, guys, and over and over and over and over and over. I just and over. got eight you'll wheel have, spins, bro. You'll have 50 of these cars. 300 you'll also times make 300k each time. And then you can go ahead and sell the cars again. How much were the cars anyway? They were cheap, man. They're cheap, yeah. They're cheap. But I'm for I just got so many more cars. There you go. So yeah. guys, if you can hear yeah, what he just said, Omar just said, so the first thing is get the BMW M6 Forza Edition, grind with the points, once you get the points, buy the Porsche, and every time you repeat the process in order to get a 300k, I've just got locked like eight wheel spins and a bunch of more cars and more money because of the wheel spins. So it's unlimited, you, you just go. keep doing it, rinse and repeat, rinse and repeat, rinse over, and repeat. Over, 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 I just over, unlocked over. the Porsche GT uh, Carrera 2003 and another Porsche. <laughs> there you go. So you heard that guys, right? I was just making money in the background doing his thing. I don't have a lot of points because like I said, I don't need to do it. I've got 
17 mil. I got every car in the game. Yo, go, yo, guys. Okay, so we're carrying on from the previous video because most of you guys got stuck on how to repeat the glitch that we did before. So the first step was to get the M6, get the points from the M6. I'm summarizing the video so you guys can watch the video already. Summarizing, get the M6, get the drift points, get the drift points, buy the Porsche. Once you have that Porsche, you get 300k. That's correct, Abby. You buy the That's thing, right. you get 300k. Yeah. Then, if you want to rinse and repeat that, you need to sell your current Porsche, which I'm going to check right now because I need to sell it before I even... He's going to buy the car fresh now, guys. And what's going to happen is we've done the trial and error. We tried to show you it that way. That way didn't work. So what we're going to do now is show you this way where you don't make the full amount because you have to spend to make, basically. But you still be flipping 150. Basically. So you buy it for 150. And you right? get 300 back. And then you'll be making 300. There you go. Then you sell it again. Then you buy another one. Instead of removing it like I did, you can always sell your car, guys. I'm just doing a free reload because I don't really care. I've got, got millions. Exactly. Right. So we're just going to show you guys exactly how to do it the one way, the second way, and this is the guaranteed way. So now we've got a fresh car, guys. Your points should come back. Remember, you're going to get wheel spins and everything, so make sure you got the points. That's the main thing. By the process of elimination, this should work, guys. So Literally. And if this works, yes. there you go. There you go. All right. There you go, guys. You got all the points back now, guys. See? So I can literally just scale up back and get a wheel spin. I'll get most of my money back, right? Let's just see. Let's just do it now. So I'm spending my points, guys. So let's let's just go through the steps again that we did then, all right? Get rid of all your Porsches that you have. That's what I did, okay? If you don't want to do that, buy a brand new Porsche, which is 150K, and see if it works. If it doesn't, do what I did. Literally, get rid of all your Porsches. Remove them. Sell them. I don't care. Go to, um, not the auction house, the garage. Buy a brand new Porsche. It's 150k. Remember, this glitch will give you 300k every time. So you're technically doubling your money. All right? 300k, take away 150k. It's still 150k left over. All right? So I'm going to do a wheel spin. Let's just see how much I can win with that. So you're going to spend 150k. But let's see straight away how much money you're going to get. So I'm spinning it now. Look at that, guys. I want a skirt. I didn't want to fuck all day, but I got a skirt. There you go. <coughs> Carry on. All right. Now I'm buying this up here. Three points over there. Going up here, five points here, going up here, and there's my money right there. I just made 300k, guys. Now, in the first time you do this, you're obviously going to get a car with zero perks on it because it's a, you, even when you're buying it, when you're following the first steps, me and Omar bought a used car from the auction, right? And we had no points on the Porsche whatsoever. Then, to repeat the process, make sure you got points, follow the M61, drift around, go to the um, Horizon Festival and buy yourself a brand new Porsche and then you'll keep making 150k because you're going to be spending 150k but then you keep rinsing and repeating and you keep rinsing and repeating and keep rinsing and repeating so I just made 300k now alright I'm not I'm going to save my points and that's it guys then you just keep doing the same thing literally same thing so to break it down so you understand like very quick and easy you can either go to the auction house and spend 35,000 and keep buying them and potentially just waste that 35 because it's already been put on there. Or you can do the guaranteed method, which is right at the very end of this video, which I just showed you now. And yeah, that, that, that is the 100% guaranteed way to do it. You get rid of all your Porsches and you buy a fresh one. You will lose out 150k, like you said. But then if you keep doing it, eventually you'll end up being up anyway. So you're always going to be up, guys. Like you, yeah, it's 300k takeaway, 150, but you're always basically glitching out 150 after that. So in the beginning, you're glitching out 300k, but there on after you get 150k every time because obviously you have to buy the car over and over and over and over and over and over again. See, he could do it so now over do. and over, guys. He could sell this car or just remove it. He could take that loss of 150k and remove it, but minor, it's not a problem. And then buy another one. That's it. Same yeah. again, he's got 300k, so now he's made 300k, my last 300k, but he's made 300k, you get it, so he's still up. So the best way to do it guys, buy the brand new Porsche, right, sell this one, buy another brand new one, you make 150k every time, every time, every time, every time, and then you keep rinsing and repeating. So if you do this 10 times, right, you made 1.5 million profit, plus the original 300k, plus all the wheel spins you're going to get. That's so you know what I mean? You're probably gonna be making about easy 
I'm just gonna easy put your maps over there like two two mil, maybe no two point five million, maybe more, because you're gonna keep getting the wheel spins every time you buy the car. You're gonna have to put the points in the wheel spin, put the wins up, get the three hundred k, then sell this one and then buy a brand new one. If you don't want to sell it, just remove it, get a new one, or don't even remove it. Just go buy a new one if you have to. Then you got all these Porsches waiting for you to sell later on. Do you know what I mean? But anyway, guys, like, share, comment, subscribe. Easy glitch. Follow all the steps, and I guarantee you'll be making money. No long thing.